construction, communications, finance. The greatest of them all is agriculture. This man makes it go and grow. There are thousands like him, businessmen in shirt sleeves and overalls, in a three by five cab instead of the executive suite. A corner of the kitchen for a boardroom and a personal concern for his shareholders. More often than not, these major shareholders may be his main labor force. The hours are long and demanding, his production subject to the vagaries of weather, and profits determined by an international market about which he knows little. His industrial site would accommodate dozens, hundreds of normal industrial plants. Yet, he runs it almost single-handedly. His equipment is more diversified than that in any other industry, and subject to both mechanical failure and plain animal orneriness. He will never see his customers. The people who consume his product are as remote as the four corners of the earth. Yet let him fail, and half the world will go hungry. But he doesn't fail. Year after year, in a growing and expanding economy, in spite of difficulties unlike that of any other business, he maintains farming in its position as Alberta's number one industry. How? Through a community of self-help called UFA, United Farmers of Alberta. Nearly 70% of all Alberta farmers belong to UFA. Farmers formed the UFA in 1909, in the days of walking plows, steam threshers, and quarter section homesteads. They owned it then, and they own it now, all $10 million worth. Farmers control UFA through annual meetings of delegates chosen to represent them. With an elected board of directors, it operates solely for the benefit of farmers. And when there's a profit on the operations, everybody shares it. Cash rebates, or patronage dividends, are earned by everyone who patronizes the UFA. In recent years, many thousands of dollars have been paid to farmers in this way. How do farmers run this business? Back in the 20s, it took a dozen men to do the job a farmer does today with machines. The workload is the same or greater, but handled much more efficiently with modern tools. Powering these machines for heavy-duty work in the agricultural industry created the Petroleum Division at United Farmers. To the UFA's 145 bulk oil agencies throughout the province, farmers come for advice on the right oils, fuels, and greases for a particular machine, or a specialized farm job. All petroleum products distributed by UFA exceed the automotive manufacturer's specifications. At government-approved laboratories, UFA's clean-burning gasolines are tested for high quality and maximum efficiency. UFA oils are guaranteed to satisfy MS sequence tests and performance requirements. The Maple Leaf Man is often a leader in the community he serves. His close contact with the farmer clients of his area keeps him on top of their needs and able to offer the farmer dependable advice. But petroleum is only one of the thousands of supplies the farmer needs to run his business. For the others, he goes to his nearest UFA farm supply center. For 
some, the needs may be more complex. A built-to-order farmstead barn. The big switch from an ordinary mixed farm to a major hog production project. Or expansion into a new promising cattle breed. Planning and creating these projects requires the work of experts, and UFA has them as well as the backup people to put these ideas in motion. New staff are carefully screened by UFA's personnel division for their ability to cope with the individual farmer's needs and problems. Farm supply center men and bulk oil agents are chosen for their practical farm background but they all dedicate their special skills to the individual needs of the farmer. Management is often helped in making decisions by the capabilities of modern machines. The decisions made by UFA today are part of the news headlines tomorrow. An informed public is the business of UFA's Information Division. It's also responsible for bringing people like you together in groups like this right here. But farming is not UFA's only business. Through organizations like Gold Eye Teen Camp, Western Co-op College, the Banff School of Fine Arts, and the University of Alberta, youth is assisted by the support of United Farmers. UFA is progressive, Alberta's most progressive farmer operation, working for you and with you.